Now we have dashboard template ready, so let's edit the header and sidebar navigation. Let's start with the removing notifications and messages and display the name of the currently logged in user. So head over to header navigation view and remove these two Li elements. And if we refresh, you can see that they are gone. So now instead of displaying this John Smith, we are going to put the real name of the currently logged in user. So we are using out package user function and we are displaying the name property and if you refresh you can see that it works so let's also remove some of the things that we are not going to use here so we want to keep the profile page and logout button The way we will make this navigation is that we will have three categories normal user, author and admin. Now let's edit the navigation links. For example, we want user to have access to the dashboard, but he will only see his own statistics. And we want user to take a look at what comments he did and what he wrote. Now, for the author, we want him to be able to take a look at what posts he did and the comments that were created on the post that that author published.
And the last section, we want admin to be able to see all the posts, all the comments, and all the users and manage their privileges. Let's not forget that admin also need dashboard. Let's now finish the logout button functionality, which we can copy from the previous navigation, where we also have the form. Now let's refresh and test it. And clearly, logout button is working.